WFNN. Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman on this Wednesday, the 13th of October, and this is the 10 a.m. Tiger Financial News Network update. The Dow's down 144 after th at 34,234 after attempting an early sell-off from the uh, inflation news and then a big spike <clears throat> and then a failure. That's been the pattern for a little while because we've been looking at these arch formations. Remember, we discussed this. I'll do that more in my show coming up, the Tiger Technicians Hour. Remember the pattern we're looking for? Straight down, then it makes an arch formation, fading at a peak A or B, comes back down and retests it, and you can go from a lowercase h to a lowercase m in a second arch formation as the Chapman Wave inside track repellent zone kicks in, which is done so many times. Look at that right there in that little inside track channel right there, pulls back. And now we're at almost at the low of the day, at minus 154. This is looking very, very weak. And the, the weekly chart is pretty much going to go to a sell mode by the end of the week. We'll see what happens it's already in a sell signal. Let's go to the S&P. The S&P at this particular point is also down, also tried to rally. It was actually a tad stronger. Now it's fading. It's down 7.5 at 43.43. Uh, you can see it's underneath the nine period moving average. Uh, well under the 14 period, doesn't look very good. QQQ, NDX 100, tried to have a rally to show some uh, strength, independent strength. It's selecting quite well. It's up $1.58 and 358.72 in price, but not the chart formation. Chart formation says it's just lacking in strength, and that's all there is to it. Uh, I think it's going to continue for a while in the NASDAQ 100. We're looking at the IWM just stuck in the trading range, down 51 at 221. Here's the surprise. The surprise is not a surprise for us, for those of us who are looking at this inflation and saying, you know, invariably gold kind of moves with an inflation record, and we've got an inflation push up, and we've got an inflation push up in the in gold, up 26 cents, uh, 26 dollars. That's 17.85. This is a big move. It's broken out to leg C. This is the pattern we were talking about. I'll talk about that in my show coming up. Let's just have a look at the dollar. The dollar's pulling back just a little bit. It's almost at uh, new recovery highs, but it is pulling back 27 ticks. And crude oil is still acting really, really strong here. It's pulling back today, but it's up near the highs. It's at 79.87, possibly making a little bit of a top. I'll be back in a moment. We've got to talk about yields as well. Basil Chapman, Tiger 